I want you to watch my hip now too, because I talked about that in the beginning, but I want you to see it and, and be aware of how this all goes together because our whole body is connected. So if I'm looking at my horse's ears and if I'm slouchy in my body, can you notice how my hip doesn't function nearly as well? Now, if I look up and I'm looking where my horse is going, can you see how my hip starts to open and close and follow my horse's movement? At the canter, our hip is a hinge and it needs to act like a hinge. If we restrict the movement in the hip, we're going to feel a lot of bouncing through the rest of our body.